Hey everyone, I'd like to share DJI moment videos with you. What the hobby I do. While I do that, I'll talk about exactly what I'm doing. I'm not using the Rode Wireless Go or any other sound, but the internal sound of the DJI Osmo Action. One of the things I don't like about my Osmo Action camera is every time that when I do a recording and I hit something wrong, the camera stays on and I'm using that quick snap. Beyond the front screen, the back screen, doesn't matter what screen it's on. It would stay on when it's on that, uh, you know, three second off thing. And just one more thing that, you know, is kind of troublesome is uh, I got to wait like five full seconds before I uh, say anything because sometimes I get that clipping. The beginning gets cut off due to the latency of any camera. Now, I gave you those issues, right? And I'm talking in a nice, loud voice. Woo. No background noise, yeah. And that's what the DJI does, any camera. It picks up the distant sounds close by we may have some trouble listening to you talk nice and soft listening to you talk nice and softly so you have to speak up sometime well I'm out here getting ready to get it right and I am going to be flying my UMX radiant something I'd like to share with you on the Osmo action camera now I got a GoPro a head strap that is and it's outdated needs to be a new one don't love it falling off my head so i'll do the best i can do to get you some footage oh yeah now that plane looks like the height i'm flying at that's 400 feet people 400 feet in my view, I'm not going to be up there, but I got to be careful. Okay, that took me some time to see if it was lit. Hard to see in the daylight. You have to throw left-handed. You do a check, elevator rudder, throttle we did. So let's get flying. Look at this toss. I didn't even throw it. That's the beauty of the hobby. Oh, very relaxing, Mr. Bug. The sun's in my eyes. It's in your eyes. Oh yeah. So let's get up there. I'm at full woot. I'm all the way up there. 100, 200 feet, 300 feet, 1,000 feet, 2,000. No, just kidding. I cut throttle. Beautiful hot day. I came out much later than usual. I am coasting. Is there any wind? No, no wind. I got the salt in my eyes from my sweat. Now my head always goes up a little higher. Don't ask me why. As I adjusted the camera down just a little, I hope I got a nice camera view. Beautiful coast. Right above head, just about. Beautiful flight indeed on the Osmo Action. Now, I tried to do a video with my Aptek GVS. Oh man, let me tell you, that was like uh, 10 times zoom. It wasn't fun. I couldn't do it. Things broke on it. Uh-oh, I don't have any uh, right turn. There we go. So I immediately did my correction. I'm down. There's a plane in the distance. Not fly this way. 
I'll probably just get one flight in today. I'll do some nearby flying for you. There you go, nearby flying. Oh yeah, look at that baby go, coasting beautifully. Now, on the uh, group, the people that hang out with, man, deceleration. <laughs> Bring your car into the dealer. Have them do a software update. Pay the money. And trying to figure out, oh, the car don't ride right. I'll cut throttle. I don't really need to have throttle. Now with these gliders, they look for hot zones, thermos. And the heat from the floor rises and you want to get into one of those thermos. And the plane will do that. It will start to climb. And you'll catch that thermal. And you'll go up and up and up. I'm just demonstrating if, if, if there was a thermal and you would just watch the tail and everything and you would climb since there are no thermos I can see maybe you can see it so let's get up there see if we can find a thermal now one of the questions is can you fly this bad boy inverted sure There you go. A little higher than that bird. Can you do a loop? Woo! There's a loop. It's got enough power to lift the 808 keychain cam. What is that? Oh! Those are those 640 by 480 camcorders. I've been dead sticking all along. Well, I made this video too long. Very informative. Give it some th stick. I don't want it to be on the ground. How do you like that? Here comes a subtle breeze from my right hand side to the left. And we'll get up to where those birds are at. <sighs> Almost like it wanted to stall. I'll fly out of the sun. We'll get up there nice and high. Well, there is some wind up there, and it just pushed me. That's why I went to one direction. And now we'll dead stick it. There we go. Sit back, relax, enjoy the rest of the show. If you uh, can see it. I'm going to come down fast. No reason, just coming down fast towards you. There it is. And here comes the subtle breeze. Maybe I could uh, get a hand catch. There you go. I'm done flying. So what I do is I pull the battery out, I grab it the best I can, I shut my transmitter off all the way down here, and I pull my wing off. Now I'm very portable. So if I ever went away, I almost dropped it, if I ever went away, the 
box goes with me. I could probably take that box, cut it down in half. I could put my camera gear in it. I don't know if I can get my radio in it. Probably can, but that's another story. I like to keep things off the grass. Now, that's the wing orientation. E Flights the company, Radian UMX. Flight test is uh, one of the uh, places you can visit and check out RC hobbies. Those guys are unbelievable. This is what was bouncing around on my ride. Now, I try to take good care of my things. When I'm finished with the battery, I put it upside down. Why? So I know that battery was used. I don't have to be out here all day for five minutes of fun. Some people got to be out here for hours on end for the fun. I'm happy it got a nice flight. I'm going to pack up and conclude my video, finish my vlog. Now, I'm also going to make other videos out here. Maybe uh, another camera video, talk about it and see what you guys have to say. Oh, man. Just stay tuned for that. So what I'm going to do is do my conclusion. And it's going to be on that mount right there. Like I said, I have to waste five minutes of video. And I hope you enjoy what I shared with you of everything in the hobby. I had one little issue. Oh, what could it have been? I don't know. When I went out, it just didn't want to turn. So I gave it another stick movement and I was safely where I needed to be. Do you hear the background playing? Is it loud? Well, now's the time they're all coming in, so that's why I don't want to be around. We play safe in this hobby. No matter what we do, we try to share the fun with whatever camera we got. If I had the GoPro on my head, good luck in trying to get that uh, filmed. Speaking of that, stay tuned on my next video so i'm all done here i've made it too long for all i shared my fun with you and i'll do the best in editing it random block you can call it e-flight umx radium 119 dollars gotta buy yourself a transmitter you gotta buy yourself the batteries you gotta get yourself a charger not a cheap hobby just as expensive as that, go pro. But the thing is, this won't let you down. This will give you endless amount of fun. But if you want to get into the bigger planes, and I used to be into it, there's a lot more to the story. Have a great day, and I'll catch you on many other videos to come. I'm Fish, and I'm out of here.